first things first we'll go get the font we want to add to canva mobile so let's go over to our browser we'll be using the chrome browser i'll be browsing 1001 freefonts.com that's the website we'll be using to get the font we want to upload to canva mobile you search for the font you want to use in the search bar up here or you could just easily go over this right up here and see what font you could get but for me i'm just going to come to the right up here and search for fonts and let's go down these are all fantasy fonts they have I don't like this fantasy fonts they have. I will go over and search for other types of fonts. Let me actually use the search bar and search for hanging letters. You must have known the name of the font you want to search for. You let's scroll. Yeah, this is the font I'm looking for. You see it's free for personal use. So click on download. But I would strongly advise you download fonts that are free not really free for personal use you could come over here to click on the license type and click on free to give you fonts that are free let's search for movie tv font wow this is beautiful yeah this transformer movie is actually free to use i think i like this magic school let's download that once you're done downloading the fonts you want to use the next thing you have to do is to go over to your folder i'm using an android phone to do this so i'll be going over to my download files to unzip the fonts i've downloaded so when i go over to canva i can be able to pick it up because if i don't unzip it i will not be able to see it these are all fonts i've downloaded hanging letters albert hello and magic school so let, let's unzip that you click on the font to extract magic magic school from the zip file so i click on extract click on delete zip file finish hanging letters i click on extract i click on delete finish so i will leave this albert and allo aesthetics so you can see what i'm trying to say if you don't want to zip your file once you've done this let's go over to canva to upload this font to upload this font to canva there are two methods you might use the first one is you can come over to teams and go over to brand kit mind you this is a paid feature in canva set up brand kit so let's click on that you must have a paid subscription on canva for you to be able to upload fonts to canva let me click on add fonts upload fonts so i'll click on this plus and i've uploaded some fonts before now let's go over to download again so if you look now the two fonts i didn't unzip the allo aesthetics and the albert text they are not uploadable you see that as i said you should extract your phone from the zip folder before you start uploading to canvas so i will upload the hanging letters say please confirm the following by uploading my own console yeah you confirm that this is used for the right intended purpose that you have right to use these fonts if we go back here and click on this plus sign and click on upload fonts you see that we've uploaded hanging letters so I'll show you the second method on how to upload fonts. So we we'll use that to upload this second font to download it. So let's go back. Let's go over to home. And let's open up a project. Let's come over to this plus sign here. And let's go over to our brand kit. If you look here, you see the option of fonts again. Come over to edit. You scroll up, you see manage uploaded fonts you can also click on the plus sign to upload another font let's go over to our download we'll be uploading the magic school let's upload magic school one yes yeah, so let's upload the second magic school now let's go back so now to apply this font to 
uploaded let's click on this text creative and go over to fonts and let's search for the fonts we've uploaded you see recently used fonts these are my recently used when you see test this is my brand kit and you see uploaded fonts this is where all your uploaded fonts will appear so which one will we use let's use the hanging letters you see that it has applied the font to be uploaded and to have a good one.